Hello again! Miss Pam here with some more practical life ideas for things you can find around your home. So today I've taken a toilet paper roll and I've just sort of poked some holes in it all around um, with a pair of scissors. And then you need a piece of string or yarn. Um, if it has the, you know, hard end on it, that's even better. Or you can create that with some tape just to give something with a little bit of uh, force in it so that you can push through. Okay, having your child um, pull it all the way through, threading it, reaching in, and pulling. So they might really enjoy the repetition of this. Just going around like that. And then they can end up with kind of a cool creation when they're done. Now, if you happen to have something like this in your home and your child's a little bit older, it's a very blunt needle, so you can't really hurt anyone. Um, but if you feel they're ready and they have the strength for that, they can practice um, you know, poking their own holes. It is quite difficult, so you might not want to offer that to your child unless you feel like it's something that wouldn't cause them too much frustration. Or you could use this in the holes that you've already created, um, just as a closer kind of feel to actual sewing. Have fun!